Zambia today is experiencing load shading with a maximum of 14 hours for both domestic and industrial customers. And the country derives electricity from water as the power generation is over 90% hydro. But now the Kariba water levels stand at 17%. From the part of Zasco Limited, customers are advised to use alternative sources of energy such as gas and solar, among other interventions. But pronouncement by the Patriot Front government to import electricity from Eskom in South Africa is a long-waiting implementation by the Zambian people, by which PEP President Sean Tambo has described it as dishonesty and lack of seriousness by the government. We are greatly disappointed with the ongoing road shedding situation and its adverse impact on a lot of businesses because currently various businesses are struggling just to remain afloat. And it must be noted that every time these businesses close down, it results in loss of employment to various Zambians and it basically increases the levels of poverty in the nation. We are equally disappointed of the fact that the government has been dishonest when it comes to their plan to import electricity from ESCOM in South Africa. Recent revelations have actually unveiled the fact that the government has not even approached ESCOM in the first place. The Zambian government has proposed 75% electricity tariffs to ZESCO by Energy Minister Matthew Sinkua. Pamela Mulenga, CBC News, Osaka.